Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Live. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel, guys. In today's video, guys, we will show you how to test the car battery, guys. We will demonstrate on a Dodge Dart, guys, how to know if your car battery is good or if it needs to be replaced. Quick introduction, guys. Every single car we get at the shop, including even this one here, guys, we make more than 200 videos, guys. We take them completely apart. And why we do that? Simply because our mission at the shop is to save you guys as much money as we can. All we need in return, please subscribe to the channel and like the video, guys. Hopefully, you will find the information helpful. Now, if you guys need to buy any replacement parts, tools, anything that we use in the video, check out guys the link in the description of the video below guys. We're going to share all that guys, okay, for your convenience. So let me show you guys what we will be doing here now. This is guys the car battery that we have. Okay, now this battery guys, it's practically new. You can see it's only, it's only one year old. But the car didn't want to start the other day and uh, we want to check guys, okay, if the battery is the problem or... Uh, something else caused that and we're going to explain how we know that now we're going to use a top-down battery tester here guys okay this is amazing too not very expensive we we'll have the link in the description of the video below it's one of the cheaper ones but it does amazing job we compared it to a high-end too and uh, we have a video guys and it turned out this is amazing too so you connect guys your uh, black cable to the negative terminal of the battery and red cable to the positive terminal now we need to find guys the specs for the battery you can see we have code cranking amps 590 and cranking amps at 32 degrees 725 now the battery voltage that we have displayed it's 12.58 we completely charge that battery. I would recommend guys to charge the battery when you complete uh, when you conduct the test. So you can get the best results you can get guys. So now what we need to do? We need to click enter. You select the language that you need. Okay, you can see there is different languages if you need something else. I select English. Now the uh it's actually in the vehicle. Okay. Select test in vehicle. Select charge after charge. Perfect. This is a normal flooded battery or EFB, gel, AGM, spiral. So you can see you just have so many guys, regular flooded hours. Cold cranking amps. This is 590 guys. Now you can change the uh, units to cranking amps, BSI, MSA. You can see so many guys. I go to cold cranking amps. Select OK and ours is 590. So I need to go up a little bit, 590. Now guys, it's testing. You can test your alternator as well, if it's charging. Now this battery guys, it says we have 530 amps out of 590. So it says it's a good battery guys. You can see definitely a good battery, otherwise it will tell you replace battery. Now we click OK. And we can go ahead and start the engine guys. Okay, if we start the engine, we can actually see the cranking test, okay, and uh, alternator charging test as well. So, let's go ahead, start it quick, and you will see what's going to happen now. Okay, I'm going to hold this thing up a little bit. Okay, RPM detected. So, it's testing now, guys. Don't start your car inside the garage, guys, always outside the garage. Cranking normal. Okay, it dropped to 10.42 volts. Charging test, let's do that as well. Loaded test. Now, what we're loaded testing, guys, okay. Uh, let's go give it a little bit of gas. For loaded test, you have to turn your uh, headlights on. Okay, that's good. Okay, perfect. So, let's turn the car off now. And what do we have, guys? Charging high. Loaded. 14.48 volts. Not loaded. 14.76. Repo normal, guys. So, you can see everything is good about the charging system as well. So, with that little tool, guys, you can test your charging system, your battery, and everything else. So, hopefully, guys, the video will be helpful. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to the channel for more videos and see you guys next time.